welcome back to our channel i have received this cool package from creality and i can't wait to start making my own laser art with the new falcon laser engraver i'm super excited thank you so much creality for kindly gifting me all of this i don't know what's in all of them but let's open them together let's get started this is the small one I was holding. I don't see a name for it, so I don't know exactly what it is. Oh, cool. We have some wood boards here. We have like, I think, 10. So these wooden boards are 300 by 300, and the working area in the laser is actually 400. I'm not sure if we can buy larger uh, wooden boards, but we will definitely see. The thickness of the board is actually 3 mm and the laser can carve through 6 mm in one pace. Let's open this bag here. We have some paper here, but I do think they told me they will send the glow-in-the-dark papers. Ooh, we have a bunch here. I'm not sure how many, probably 50. But look, they are black. So probably when you scratch them, they will uh, have that part that will glow. So can wait to try this also. Next, we have the laser engraver enclosure. This is going to be so perfect. So in our room won't be a lot of smell from the laser engraver we have like this protective case the fume exhaust the fan everything you need in this box to protect your lungs and it won't make a lot of smoke in the room let's see what's in this big one So here we have the honeycomb base. This is going to protect the table you are working on. It's going to be perfect. It is super large. Last but not least, the Falcon laser engraver, 10 watts power. We have some stickers here, instructions how to assemble it but they also sent me a really helpful installation tutorial which i am going to put down in the description so you can go and watch it when you are assembling yours we do have a lot of pieces here and i'm not sure uh, how long this is going to take me to build probably i will call also my husband to help me with this project to build so let's get everything out of the box. The enclosure is right there and here are all the pieces for our laser engraver. Are done building the falcon laser engraver it looks really good actually in the instructions video they had the smaller honeycomb and this looks even cooler with the big one so we have the 500 by 500 one you definitely should get this one because it's extra protective for your desk and everything so we actually have this piece here which we are going to use here in the front side we can see the USB port, we also have the type C and we can uh, add directly from the website the very cool, look how many models we have there, turn it on.
the laser comes with this USB stick that you can insert into your computer and copy the file you need on this SD card and then insert it directly into the printer. I inserted the USB from them and it has laser engraving machine, user manual, software, operation video, decode, focus, eagle cut, the recommended parameter. Let's go with light burn. Start your free trial. Connecting the laser with the USB type C cable. On MED.com we have lots of free files that we can print. I am so excited that spooky season is so close and I'm going to print a lot of cool things, different things. I have inserted my wooden board. Now with this thickness adapter, I'm going to set to three millimeters. Place it like that and just tie the screws on the side. So the frame was checked, the parameters were set. Hopefully everything is okay. This is going to be my first try. I'm really nervous about it. So I'm not going to put the protective case over it uh, right now because I want to show it how it looks, how it's going to work without it on top. Plus my desk is a little bit small, so uh, the edges won't be covered anyways. So I have to place it probably on the ground or on a bigger table and uh, let's see how the first one will go i already opened my window just so the smoke can go out as much as it can goggles on pressing start three two one So here is my first project and it's done. So because it only has thin lines, uh, it didn't make so much smoke. I do have my window here so I didn't have the uh, protective cover installed but I do have it uh, prepared here. I just need to put this on the ground or on a different table because it's not fitting my cover here. It is set down on the ground. My window is and now the cables will go through this hole here, both the power cable and the USB to connect it to the laptop. The fume exhaust, I put it right here in the corner of the window but we will definitely need to improvise something else. Let's plug in the fan cable also. The fan is on and working. I selected the picture of my daughter. Let's frame and see if this is going to work. So we just move it around until we are satisfied with our position.
Let's get it out. I'm so curious to see it. Oh my gosh, that's so precious. That looks so good. I could have made this probably a bit darker, but I am still learning and I'm still getting used to these settings, but it looks amazing. So my settings were set to millimeters per second and now I changed them to millimeters per minute in order to match their uh, recommended parameters. So I suggest you will do the same. I'm ready to cut my first board using the laser engraver and I have chosen 200 millimeters per minute speed and the power 100 max percent. Here is our awesome project. Oh my gosh. Uh, it's falling apart. Here are all the pieces and they look super awesome. Cut really smooth. Almost any imperfections on the side. So let's glue all of these together here and we will see the final result. Just look at how beautiful this turned out. It's wonderful. I had a little bit of extra glue here and there and I had to scrape it off. So the last thing that I want to try out are the glow in the dark scratch paper they have sent me. Let's see how this is going to look. You can barely smell anything from this, they hardly make any smoke honestly. to show this my daughter okay let's see how it glows that's too cute how awesome is that so here is the projects that i have did until now i absolutely love this table decoration i love my family it's so true and uh, this painting with my daughter is so beautiful i definitely need to work a little bit more on the settings for the paintings but it looks already so nice i think i can also put a thin layer of polish and it will look so good and it will shine these uh glow in the dark sheets are so cool and you can make so many things with them i absolutely love how it turned out it's actually perfect and the settings were uh, very easy to follow the trick or treat the pumpkin one which was the first one that i did i already know how i could have done this even better because you can select the outlining and then you can set it to cut so i didn't know that in the beginning so this is definitely not hard for a beginner to learn the cool thing is that you will get uh, on the usb stick 
the parameters how to set your laser engraver how to engrave and how to cut through wooden boards or different materials i also want to try out different materials but this is all that i had uh, for now so make sure you are following us also at Tanya's Toys Review where I am going to post a lot of short projects for Halloween, for Christmas and different cute things like uh, this ghost here because I'm going to make a lot of projects for my daughter also. Thank you again so much Creality for kindly gifting me this laser engraver. I absolutely love it and I can't wait to do a lot of fun projects with it. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this unboxing and review. Bye guys.